Hi Beach Babes, it's Karina Katrina and we're back with more of our favorite bikini bites. So on these hot summer days, it's always important to stay hydrated. We love to add fruit to our water. And in here, we added mango. We also like doing uh, soda water, especially if it's all natural, and then putting the fruit in there, and it kind of the that, bubbles get yeah, it. Yeah, I love bubbles. It's delicious. So if you're at work, just bring some frozen fruit, and then you get a treat. Once you drink it, you get you the frozen it. mango. It's yep. delicious. Perfect. Kombucha. Oh yeah, you know we love kombucha. Kat is Miss Ginger Aid fan. This is my favorite. And then I love the guava goddess. I like any of the pink ones, like the cosmic uh, cranberry and uh, the mango one. And then um, I also love this one, oh, yeah. Bucha Kombucha. Ooh. Guava mango, so delicious. Yeah, it's really good. A lot of you were asking about kombucha and we have about a half a bottle a day. We love it, it's really refreshing. But then also, since we drink coffee and we drink wine and certain parts of our diet is acidic, um, we like to balance our alkalinity, which is really, really important for your health. We also love green tea. So this is Yerba Mata, pure empowerment. Um, it's delicious, it's just pure iced tea with um, a little bit of organic uh, cane sugar for sweetener. And this is straight up unsweetened green tea. I love this and I, I like putting a little uh, mint in mine and it's good for a kick. If you're not a coffee drinker, there's a little natural caffeine in it and it gives you energy or in the afternoon we like to have green tea. If you're sensitive to caffeine, yeah, just non -caffeine. don't have it. Yeah, or just don't have it in the afternoon because it will keep you up. But I, I need it in the afternoon. Yes, go green tea. <laughs> On to the good stuff. <laughs> yeah, let's just get that started. You know, <laughs> beach babes love champagne. At least these two here. <laughs> We, um, this is a Prosecco, which is a sweeter champagne, and it's actually a sparkling wine, but you know, delicious. We'll, we'll sample it for you, let you know how it tastes. So this is for all you beach babes. And we have like three glasses of champagne that day. <laughs> if you follow us on Instagram, you know we love our champagne, so. All right, all right. You ready? <laughs> Hey, All right. shower. So that's good. Uh, we don't have any glass. Oh, yes, we do. If you're on the beach and you don't want to bring glass, then these are the perfect cup for you. They're by Go Vino and they're plastic. You can throw them, you can drop them, they won't break. They're really good for us at home, actually. Yeah, we use them at home too. We broke all of our glassware, so this is what we now have. Yeah. Okay, cheers. Cheers, cheers beef babes. And this is another cheers. You guys have been doing amazing checking in. The bikini series is just, you're blowing us away. It's awesome. All right, so you know that we love champagne. Now moving on to wine. If you're going to a beach picnic or you're going on a little date night or anything and you pack them on to go, we love these. Fox wine. Yeah, we love Cal Natural. We yeah. featured that before. We actually found this at Whole Foods. It's Bota Box. Um, we've never had this. We love the Cal Natural, so let's try this too. Ooh, that's good. Yeah, let me taste yours. Oh, Mine? This is Pinot Grigio, so it's a little sweeter, and then Chardonnay is usually a little bit more butterier. There's also a Cabernet Sauvignon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what else? What? You can make spritzers with oh, right. wine. Oh, right, right, right. So I like it with a Chardonnay or any kind of white wine. It's a yeah. really fresh, refreshing summer drink. Is you put half a glass of wine and then add, you can add flavored um, soda water. Like this is- Or just the, straight up soda water. Yeah, and yeah. squeeze a little lemon in there or mm -hmm. add some strawberries or some fruit. Ice cubes. We don't have ice cubes out here right now. But this cuts your calories in half. And keeps you hydrated. And if you're at, you know, a party, a picnic or something like that, and you don't want to drink all the wine, all right, but I'm gonna just pour my own. Oh, I thought we were sharing. <laughs> Cheers to half the calories, and it's delicious, bubbly, and, and fun. To the bikini series. Up next is our favorite food group, which is fruit, and we don't stay away from fruit. It has essential vitamins, uh, nutrients, digestive enzymes, 
fiber, everything. We want you to have fruit. If someone out there told you not to have fruit, they're wrong. wrong. Yeah, a, so, a piece of fruit never made anyone fat, remember? Heck no. Yeah, that's right. So okay. these are some of our favorite fruits right now. I've always been a banana girl. Yep. And along with this banana, oh. I love my peanut butter. <laughs> peanut butter, almond butter, whatever it is. And these yeah. Justin's little packets, and these are great for on the go. Yeah. And some of you were talking about what you can have before your booty call. A half a banana is perfect. Up next, we have our berries. We love berries. They are full of antioxidants. And if you work out, you create a lot of free radicals, so you need to build that back up. So eat your berries, beach babes. <laughs> and apples. Apple day. Keep, keep the, the doctor, doctor away. away. And your trainers. Actually, you oh. don't want to keep us away. And apples are also good with peanut butter, almond yeah. butter. <laughs> All right, and I love frozen mango. She does. I don't know what it is about frozen mango, but I'll have this before my booty call if I'm doing something more than 40 minutes of working out. And you know what always reminds me of summer? It actually reminds me, my dad growing up always sat on the porch and ate his watermelon. Yeah. Yum. We love watermelon. And it's really low in calories, so. It's very hydrating. It's and then um, grapefruit. The fat burning food. Oh this yeah. Is, there's so many benefits to grapefruit. We'll put a little link below too about all the benefits of grapefruit. It is a metabolizing fruit. Up next. Lemons. The power of a lemon. We love lemon on our fish at dinner. We love a lemon Chicken. squeeze in water with warm water first thing in the morning. Even it's over really asparagus cream. when you grill it or veggies when you grill it. Or if you want to marinate your kale. Yeah. It softens your kale salad. A lot of you are asking us too what we marinate our kale in. A little bit of this, and grapeseed oil. Oh and, my gosh. Yeah. And we use lemon in a lot of babe shots. Oh yeah. And avocado. Yes, we love it in our salads. We love it in our smoothies. It gives that, that creamy texture. For dressings. Oh yeah, salad dressings. That's and really dips. Good. Yeah. And on our egg white omelets. Oh yeah, you can use it as a spread, anything, or you can cut it in half and then drizzle uh, a little honey on it with some sunflower seeds. It's a really good snack. So we love it's avocado. Yeah. yeah. Last but not least, we have trail mix. It's the perfect thing for on the go. You can just package it up however you like it and take it with you in a plastic baggie. Right here we have goji berries. If you haven't tried goji berries, they're really good. Yes, they're full of antioxidants. They're a great superfood. We have almonds, raisins, cashews. And in this, we put a little kick, so a little cayenne. I mean, sometimes you like it spicy, sometimes you like it sweet. I like to add some carob to mine. We love it for dessert. And ooh, cocoa dusted almonds. Oh my God. Those are the best. Or you know what? We love chocolate covered almonds, but if you're you know, slimming down for summer or doing a bikini series, then you can do cocoa dusted almonds for dessert. Mm -hmm. Tune in next week. We're going to show you what's in this basket. What's in the basket? I don't know. We have to come <laughs> back until then. Check in with us. Comment below. What is your favorite bikini bite? Yep. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, yeah, you should squeeze the whole thing <gasps> I, in there. Oh, my gosh. That's what I was thinking. It was you, my mind, your mouth. <laughs> Cheers.